hello my dear Aquarians! The same thing happened to uh, Pisces in the Polish version it was just the batteries this month is so full of energy that the batteries are drained so quickly. Okay, so you have a separate reading. November 2018 is a very, very interesting month for everybody. Number 11 month in 2018, so it's number 11, and on the first 10 and 11, we have all ones. So it's 11s, 11s, onces, it's all about us and our gateway. Where are we going? To our new reality, we're becoming butterflies, we want grow spiritually, that's what the path we're choosing. So everybody have interesting month because even the planets changing signs, Mercury from the half of the month until December 6th will be retrograding. Um, Jupiter leaves finally Scorpio and goes into Sagittarius for the next year. So it's going home. It's going to be wonderful energy. And uh, Venus also Finally, Venus, Venus, Venus on the 17 goes forward in Libra 15 degrees. Again, change, change, transformation. New moon on the 17th in Scorpio, 15 degrees. The beginning of change. And the full moon on the 23rd in Gemini. So that's your sister sign, right? Okay, so what is for you, my dear... Aquarius. Let's start with the message from the other side. Be proud. Beautiful. It's time to celebrate all that you have achieved, all that you are, and all that you will become. Every once in a while, it's important to stop and acknowledge what you have achieved and to be proud. Wow, you can give yourself a pat in the back, okay, because they're saying, you're good, you've been doing good, and you're going in the right direction. Okay, so we're starting with the lovers. The lovers, the lovers, okay, so some of you, it may be in a loving relationship, uh, in a loving marriage, or you just met someone, some of you, I hear this, maybe just a couple of people, but I have to say it's a third party involved. But you would know. That wouldn't be a surprise for you, actually. Mm -mm. But you're saying it takes two to tango, and three is one too many, too many. Or for some of you, somebody is just putting their nose where it doesn't belong. Sorry, dear uh, aquar aquarium. Okay, but also your health may be improving, and for other of you, the message is: whatever decision this month you're making, no matter what, let it come from your heart. Your heart, okay, and reach out to give help and to receive help, help, okay, communicate clearly, be creative. Maybe you have something with your siblings, short traveling, for everybody will be different. The grace card says faith, have faith. Every event we experience and every person we meet has been put in our path for a reason. Life lessons. I tell you, when we leave this planet and we will go to the spirit world, what we come back with is our life lessons, our spiritual knowledge. So everything happens for a reason. No matter what, don't be upset, relax, happens for a reason. Now in some relationships, I see problem may appear or already was because of the career or finances, which may be somebody is working too long, not enough with the partner or the family. 
in some relationships, I think Leo had this card, maybe it's not enough money. And now we're starting to argue because it's not enough money. Something those lines, okay? But in the middle of the month, you have a magician. You're like a magician. You may start something totally new, listening and watching the signs that are coming through your crown chakra and opening your heart, expanding, okay? Opening up new possibilities. Now, I always say the magician is a double edge sword. If you're positive, optimistic, you expecting the best, that's what will happen. But if it's the other way around, that will happen as well. So, what you are opening up to. Boy, in some relationships, passion, passion, passion. Or you simply, if you're not in a relationship and you don't meet anybody new, you may be passionate about what you're doing. You just love what you're doing, which that's wonderful. And boy, boy, that never happened before. You live in this month going towards December with two devil cards. Two different decks and two devil. For some of you, you may be involved in triangles, but that somebody has again triangle. Triangle within, within the triangle. That's not good. For some of you, you're meeting somebody who is codependent on something or someone, has some dependency that you wouldn't like uh, at all. Some of you suddenly feeling trapped. Maybe you too much into material things. Maybe that's why this was showing up, the career and finances. Some of you starting to worry. Be fearful. That's not acting from heart. Acting from fear. Dark, heavy energy. And your heart is closed. They're showing me some of you heart is closed. Maybe the previous experiences and now you're even afraid to show your real self. Show uh, for who you uh, really are, how beautiful you are, because you're afraid of being hurt again. Oh my God, that's the first time I see two devils. Yeah, lots of fear. What's going on, Aquarius? Lots of fear. Watch out. Not just what you're thinking and what you're creating this month of uh, November, but who you're getting involved with, who you're listening to. Is that person really truly are who they say they are? Hmm. Other messages are on Vimeo on Demand with healing. The link down below, you may also have a private reading. Astrology, numerology, portrait, sent on a video to you, very good. And or as life's reading. So additional messages when the wall between the dimensions uh, is thin this month. What a month, okay. Hmm. And until we meet.